Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are watching this out there on the World Wide Web. This is Jeremy Geenan for Syscon TV. I'm here at 11th Cloud Expo, Cloud Expo Silicon Valley, as is Praveen Kankaraya, CEO of Impetus Technologies. We're honored, sir. Likewise, Jeremy. <laughs> well, we're with you. <laughs> Impetus, as usual, all very, very active around this show, active in the big data space, just active generally, I think. How should we catch people up with what's been going on with Impetus? Uh, Impetus has become very busy working with large companies. That's been a huge shift in our business, helping with them with their big data initiatives and their cloud computing initiatives. And, and large companies are struggling. There are too many choices to make. And uh, the teams are also under pressure to prove the ROI to their management. The management said all of these companies, you know, the C-level management is convinced that that's the direction to go, but what should be the pace, and they want to be able to justify the expense to their shareholders, and that's where we come in. We really so help them make... You're helping, you're helping them articulate it. Uh, articulate and create evidence of success. Right. So strategizing via impetus, via your experience. Now, I'm interested by that, that you say now that you're bigger companies, and you weren't necessarily planning on that? It's just gone that way. Uh, no, it hasn't gone that way. It's, uh, it was actually by design. We, we wanted to work with large companies and we really changed our messaging and figured out what large companies needed. And, and we are going ahead and delivering that. So large companies are taking notice and almost all the accounts we have signed up in the last 12 months are billion plus, billion dollars plus companies. It seems counterintuitive to me that they would need help. How did they get to be such huge, vast companies if they couldn't get their arms around the conjunction of cloud and big data? Uh, that's, that's a great question, Jeremy. <laughs> uh, so they do have a lot of data. It's not that they are short of data. <laughs> and uh, what's happening is uh, a regular large company which was using information technology on the cost side of business to count their inventory, pay their employees, and manage their supply chains, are now seeing technology, information technology flow onto the revenue side. Right. And that's a huge shift. And I don't think very many pundits are taking notice of this. Yeah, and then I'll give you a stark example. You know, you look at a book publisher like McGraw-Hill. I'm sure they used all the ERP systems to count their inventory and do their supply chain planning and all that. But now they're being forced to turn into a technology company. They have to yeah. deliver their content wrapped in technology, not on paper. So what you're saying is they don't necessarily then have the expertise. They didn't all get into the industry for the reason they wanted to be technologists. They were publishers and now they're de facto, they have to get their mind around the technology. A absolutely. Look at Ford Motors. They're yeah. running an app store now. Yeah. It's incredible. Now how did impetus get into the whole space to start with? What, what started you off on cloud, let alone big data? So it's partly luck uh, in the sense that we were working with very large systems. Uh, one of our old customers, you know, who's, they've been a customer for 10 years and they co-presented with us here. Right. Uh, they handle one out of every two DNS requests on the planet. Okay. So we've been fortunate to work with customers who where you know we've sh we've shared these challenges with them, and no wonder we yeah. So you've always been at the you've always been at the, the the sweet spot, yeah. And so why wouldn't you be here? What does the future hold? You think for this world where I mean you've that's given a great example you've given that a company that didn't necessarily think it was going to be a technology play now is that makes one think that this cycle could last for you know two decades as people catch up with that. Absolutely. And, you know, another layman's way I explain this to myself and my fellow colleagues is, can you, can you count the number of lines of code which is on, I'm carrying on my body right now? My watch has tens of thousands of lines of code. My phone has more lines of code than my first desktop 20 years ago. So, yeah, you know, yeah. the complexity of software is just going up. And it's way more stark when you go to parts of the world like Africa and India. Uh, so the need for leading edge software is only growing. And, and it'll be, you know, the, it'll need a dose of reality. Uh, the hype wave alone will not carry this. So 
like we're here, I'm, I'm sure you're going to be asking me later on the panel, uh, what is holding the adoption of big data and cloud computing? Uh, and I, I feel, uh, you know, the, the workforce in an enterprise has to get used to all the analytics which is being spewed out by the big data systems, the early big data systems. It's going to be an intriguing journey. Impetus Technologies is going to help steer the way as ever, as is Praveen personally. Thank you so much, sir, you, for joining us here again. Praveen Kankaria from Te Impetus Technologies, and thank you for uh, following out there on the World Wide Web.